from hypersexualized dog food ads, passing through new details of Johnny Silverhan and his love, Alt Cunningham. This episode is packed with small details I'm sure you missed out when watching this trailer. If you missed any of the previous one or just want to watch the unreleased episodes, make sure to check the info on the video description. Before we get started, I will play the segment from 56 to 1 minute and 8 seconds. So let's get started. Endless possibilities and endless lies. We are fucked, America. Uh, where is this? I don't know. Bohemia, some uh, eating plus bar here. <laughs> yeah, that's a that's a fun club right there. Mm -hmm. King size. Fun time. Oh, dream. king size. This is the weirdest ad because you see like this overweight dude because mm -hmm. like the, the person sitting behind the drink, he's holding a big, he's holding a beer to his crotch, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And so. Yeah. You know, it's just this big chubby dude with the girl just looking at him like, huh? And the and the like, logo for this company is like this this woman with really big breasts and some I don't know something coming out from their their breasts like. Is it a titty bump drink? I don't think so. I mean, why? How would it be? But I don't know. I mean, it could be. It is a cyberpunk world, and you got to remember, it's, it's kind of like a. It reminds me of Mad Mad Max Fury Road. Yeah. How like yeah. you have the ladies that they would take milk from use it from their breasts with like the suction cup machines or whatever. But it doesn't make a lot of sense but i don't know maybe 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 and there's this girl because apparently daisy dukes are a thing in night city right daisy dukes and panty shorts <laughs> are, are a big are a big vibe they are very popular all right oh foreign body oh god here we go again foreign body, foreign body. <laughs> and the dog the freaking, the freaking dog thing again <laughs> I just, I just can't don't notice there's a dog here on the middle as well. All right. <laughs> the dog's like licking their lips really hard. They're just like, oh my God, the dog's food. <laughs> like, this is so wrong, man. Uh, uh, oh, another fun size. size. Yeah. Oh, there's another girl. This poor woman having to deal with this big chubby dude just. <laughs> and we have here again so fresh, it tingles in your mouth. Yeah, I don't think I want meat worms. I'm good. And this is so creepy. Yeah. I have no idea. Is it an orange? Yeah, I think it is. Maybe it's supposed to be like a fruit. Fresh orange or something. I don't know. And Liz's again. Liz's club. Um, yeah, some what? dancing. Is, is that cyberware above her butt? Uh, maybe. I would assume I have no it clue. could be. Yeah, I wouldn't be surprised. Some folks brain dancing, I guess, right? Because this is a brain dance terminal here, right? Yeah, this man's probably dance. getting his freak on, I'd imagine. The way he's danced. Yeah, probably having some fun. Probably a couple having some fun as well. Because that would make a lot of sense, I guess. But the thing is, I would question, like, if you're a couple going in, why not do that IRL? Well, maybe you're looking for, like, a far way, and I don't know. I mean, could be. <laughs> I wouldn't, because, I mean, no, it was a film with... Sylvester Stallone and, and um, one other lady, they had like a brain dance type machine where they were having have, making love to one another. But it was so realistic that they ended up backing out of it. So, but they, it, it was something like that where they had sex in like this different universe. It could be something like that. Either way, I love her dress and her shoes. So, yeah, those are some cool shoes. I bet they're not comfortable though. Uh, it doesn't matter if her legs are not human, it's like it'd be prosthetic. So, it doesn't really matter. True, but I'm just like, man, that angle, that's got to be. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe she has uh, enhanced uh, ankles, cyber Maybe. ankles. Some 20 milligrams of something. 20 mgs. Maybe it's like an enhancement pill? Or mm -hmm. just some recreative drugs. Wait, that's that's Johnny. It is? Yeah, look, look at his left arm. Oh, yeah. That's it is. This is Johnny. It is Johnny. So this is a brain dance sequence or a dream sequence. Yeah. But this is definitely Johnny. So this That's is him true. right before he goes live on concert. Probably, yes. That would make a lot of sense. Yeah. And this could be him as well. Yeah, this is him. Yeah, this is this is him. Yep. So he is that all cunning him in front of him? Where? Oh, you yeah. see the girl? Look at the look at girl. Like, yeah. Look oh the my, uh, okay, now I have to open the actual video and open this frame and check the frame by frame, actually, like really frame by frame. Because I missed that. Wow. You can see her face below his thumb. Look at his thumb. Mm-hmm. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, this is the first time we ever saw her, I think. 
No, she was shown previously in the previous oh, really? um, Night City Wire. When they did the Becoming Samurai, you can see her in the back behind Johnny. Mm, when he was looking at himself I in the mirror. I missed that. All right, so this is her. Amazing. So yeah, this is all silver hand here, and he's drinking... What is this here? Dickin? Oh, Dickin. Yeah, it says D-I-C-K-E-N. Yeah. I-N. All right, so drugs and alcohol, and probably sex. That's rock and roll life right there. Nice. Yep. Classic. Uh, the sequence of that... Uh, Lizzie shot with the girls dancing. Uh, so and this is V, right? And we have two cups. So somebody made a meme. They're like, so you, they lied when they said they, you can't do a world in the game. And they showed this <laughs> shot of him holding two glasses. I'm like, bro. <laughs> All right. That, that was good. Like you can't do a world in 2077. <laughs> <laughs> that was really good. Uh, yeah, the same shot. So we are sort of offering to her, but she's not going to have it. Uh, oh, I just noticed that this is probably a guy with his bum. I like how he's clothed all the way. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And then the chicks like, aren't. That's, just, that's weird. Like, like a corpo suit or something. Yeah. Maybe it's that same corpo guy. He just got <laughs> drunk enough to get on stage <laughs> and start doing stuff for people. <laughs> Somebody's going to record him while he's there and put it to the higher ups, man. Maybe that's, that's what that's we're doing there. Slide. Maybe that's our quest. <laughs> maybe that's maybe this is his pastime. Okay, another shot of Night City. Those buildings are so huge. Deep show. So probably a stripper club. Probably so. It's a car brand, 24-7 store. And it's so stunning to look the amount of windows we have here. These K2 buildings are quite unique because I don't think I ever saw them on any other place of the city so i'm assuming they might be like luxurious building high-end core apartments or something i would assume so yeah because they are not common and they look on a good place of the city as well like clean you know mm, this show there's that flag again yeah talking about. that flag is probably new america's flag probably i feel like i, I would like this talk show though because she's like the first line she says we're fucked america we don't know how to get out of it mm -hmm. i'm like this this has got to be like a political show i would imagine this is probably, probably very political talking about like all the things going on in night city who's going for mayor mm -hmm. what's going on with the government what's going on in the city streets with like casualties and crime and considering the the callers it, it looks like she's supporting the other candidate not the 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 one that lucius is backing up so yeah Maybe she's supporting the other one and it might be um <laughs> Because there's a line, she's like, three homeless, homeless. Yeah, yeah. I think it's homelessness is rising 300%, like 300%. Yeah. Uh, the Night City nuclear power plant, because there is one, right? There's a nuclear plant there. Yes. In Night City. Yeah. There is. That's the industrial district. Mm -hmm. That's for sure. Some nuclear. Actually, this waste. is a biological waste, right? Yeah. This this symbol is for biohazard materials. All right. So that's oh, the waste this field. This is a truck. I just noticed that this is a flipping. Yeah, truck fell over. People in hazmat suits. So this is in the Badlands. It looks so, yeah. The There's a, a road here in the back. There's a guy just chilling there. Is that armor truck? No, the, yeah, it right looks there? like a Razaka trucks, isn't it? Might be, because they do have a, they do haul a truck away up there in the distance. Yeah, that, that's totally Badlands for sure. But it's sort of close to the city because there's a big tower here. There's right? Night City. Yeah, Night yeah. City right there. Maybe the same dumpster. This is like a DTR Raider, apparently. Turbine for see if we can see any PlayStation 7 here on the garbage. <laughs> Maybe. Yeah, just plain garbage. Nothing fancy here. Containers. Same girl again. This, this hairstyle is really in high in Night City as well. A lot of people use them. I actually like her look a lot more than the other ones, to be honest. She's a lot more clean, a lot more respectful, a lot more professional and uh, formal. Mm -hmm. Just wearing like the, the long sleeve striped shirt, rolled up sleeves, the khakis. Nothing fancy, but uh, also not like super casual. I like it. And she lacks uh, apparent cyber enhancements as well. So yeah, I was about to say, she doesn't have much visible cyberware, so I'm wondering, does she have anything? And that would be all for the fifth episode. Man, I can tell you, the closer we get to this game, the higher is my hype. I am planning some unbelievable post-launch content, so if you don't want to miss any of that, smash that subscribe button right now. As always, thank you so much for watching, and I see you next time.